All right, welcome. How do you add a note to your cart? This is such an important factor for so many businesses. I've used this in many of my online stores and Shopify stores in the past and currently. You can do this super easy from just a plain old Shopify theme. Right now we're using the Dawn 13.0.0 one version this is a free Shopify theme. And of course, every theme that you use, whether it's Shopify or third party, if it's free or paid, they all have different features and sections and none is the same. But if you're looking to add a note to your cart, you can do so really easily. And it was tripping me up on actually where this was. I was looking all over the cart page and I couldn't find it because you click around here, you can see the multiple options for the sections. I was clicking around the settings. It wasn't in the admin either. And this is because it's hidden a little bit, but once you get to your cart page, not your product page or your checkout page, because the checkout page can't be customized. Once you get to your cart page, you can go to your theme settings here. And then we scroll down our theme settings here. We can go to cart right here at the bottom. Again, all themes are very, very different. But for the Dawn theme on Shopify and a few other themes, I'm pretty sure as well, we have this cart option here. We click cart drop down and there's a few things here and there's a checkbox right here. See this? That says enable cart note. So what we have to do is enable this and we will see the order special instructions appear right in this blank area. It seems like this should maybe be enabled by default. As you can see, there's a big blank area here that's screaming to be used for something because if we click the subtotal block, we can't add anything, only padding and change the color of the theme. But if we go once again to our theme settings and we go to our cart, we can enable cart note. So what does this do? So this can be used in so many different ways. And once you know about this, it can definitely get your brain storming your brain brainstorming. And so essentially all that would happen here is that if somebody is ordering something that needs a special note, this is super important for restaurants or bakeries or florists or customizable goods, anything like that, a customer can just write anything they need. So essentially all that would happen here is when the customer picks their item, adds it to the cart, goes to their cart page, they can see order special instructions and that goes right to you. So they can write anything into this box here. This, or th this, this will be submitted and then once I click checkout, this will be submitted with the order. It's a shame it doesn't say it on the checkout screen to give the customer some peace of mind that it actually went through. But essentially all that happens is this special instruction is inputted into the order here. And then once the order is placed, you go to orders and then in your orders tab, uh, you have your columns like this. And then right beside the checkbox, there's a little note icon that looks like this. It's kind of just a little note like this and it has like three lines. And then once you click this note that is right here, you can see the special order instructions. Sometimes this is like a gift or a birthday or a special order instructions, you know, for your business. But if you ever needed, this is a very important feature for a lot of businesses. And if you don't have it and you're thinking about using it, once again, we just go customize, we go theme settings, scroll down to our cart, enable cart note. And then from the cart page, we see the order special instructions here that can be enabled. And then that is shown with the order on your order tab in your admin. I hope this helps guys. I know how important this can be and how hidden it is. It's not extremely clear. And I find some of the instructions on tiny little things like this are sort of rare to find. So if this helps, let me know. Give me a thumbs up on the video so I know that you've helped. And if you want to join a Shopify community, a free Shopify community here on YouTube, where we just all come together to learn from each other's experiences and grow our businesses together, consider subscribing. And if you do, I'll see you in the next video.